How to avoid bad taste in mouth while inflating balloons. I inflated balloons recently for my child's birthday. After five balloons or so, I had bad taste in my mouth. Drinking water helped a bit, but the bad taste stayed for few hours. Any way to avoid it, e.g. some way to inflate the balloon without having it directly in my mouth? Any short section of tube, a drinking straw, section of pipe, ballpoint pen with the ink cartridge removed etc. can be used to inflate a balloon without coming into contact with the rubber. Insert the tube into the neck of the balloon. If the tube is smaller than the neck, pinch the slack and then roll it so the balloon wraps the tube well. By leaving part of the tube sticking out of the balloon you can then inflate the balloon without touching the rubber. Before now I've had good success using one of those nozzles that comes with a cartridge of silicone sealant. It can be trimmed so it has a big hole in one end but still has a tapered section that makes it easier to feed into the balloon neck. If you fill balloons and other things often it would be worth investing in a double action inflator pump. Enter image description here. The rate these things inflate balloons is unbelievable, maybe 3 to 5 cycles. They're also great for paddling pools, air beds, water inflatables etc. All things that stay mold-free longer if they aren't inflated with moist air from your lungs.